I have never felt this self-conscious. Jazzercise, anyone? Hi, this is Nikki Terry Style. If you're new here, I want to say welcome. This channel is all about thrifting, style inspiration, DIY thrift flips, plus size fashion, vintage, and sustainable fashion. So if you like the sound of that, please subscribe for new videos every Sunday. And thanks for being here. Today's video is going to be a really special vintage haul or collection, I guess. So the story is, I'm currently in the process of getting ready to sell my childhood home. And so while cleaning it out, I found a closet basically full of vintage clothing. And I thought it'd be really cool to share it with you. It's sort of a time capsule of various times in my life of collecting vintage clothes as well as clothes that belong to my mother in the 70s and 80s. So basically it's 70s through Y2K styles, a big mix of everything. You can see there's quite a bit behind me and I just thought it be nice to share it with you. So I'd love to just show you a lot of the pieces and some of the things I'll go ahead and try on just for fun. And I hope you really enjoy just seeing this time capsule of vintage uh, from my life. So let's get started. I found this cool cropped Hawaii t-shirt that I'm pretty sure I thrifted in the 90s. Would totally wear this today. And this is a 1990 Water Ski Club t-shirt. This Ghostbusters tee from the original movie in 1984. This orange baseball tee was a favorite of mine in high school. This Mickey tee from my 1997 trip to Disneyland, I think. It's a fun early 90s New Orleans t-shirt. <laughs> oh, this t-shirt. It's kind of tone deaf for today's woman, you know what I mean? <laughs> but it's kind of funny. 1989 Independence Bowl. So like in the late 90s, there was this thing where Curious George got like really popular for teenagers and 20 somethings and uh, yeah, I have a collection of a few Curious George t-shirts. And here's a couple of fun ones from the 80s when I was very small. Bartman and Batman. I also decided to keep a couple of the vintage scrunchies that I found since those are making a comeback these days so this will be fun to wear. This is a dress my mother made. I can't zip it up all the way but I thought it'd be fun to try. And same pattern, I think she made this one too. It actually does fit me, but I can't reach to zip it all the way. And my mother made this one as well. This was her wedding dress in 1977, and it totally doesn't fit me. I think is a 60s or 70s sweater dress. It has a vintage tag on it and it does have a few holes so I apologize for that but the color is pretty. This is a little vintage 90s floral dress. And I put it over a t-shirt just to style it a little. Pretty excited about this dress. I definitely, this is something that I would wear uh, in the springtime, I think. Maybe even in the winter, layered up. little 
vintage lace dress. I think it's homemade as well. And this 1970s shawl. I have never felt this self-conscious about something that I've tried on for you guys, so we'll just see. But uh, it's just too crazy. I have to show you this. <laughs> I don't know if it's supposed to fit like it's an actual top. It's just way too small for me, but yeah, crazy. And it has stirrup bottoms that I actually couldn't figure out exactly how they go over your feet, but yeah, stirrups. Jazzercise, anyone? Okay, but just imagine if this jumpsuit from the 90s actually fit me well, or was on somebody more petite. Huh? These amazing 90s overalls. They're definitely too small on me, obviously, like most of the stuff. Look at this gorgeous, like, milkmaid style prairie dress. I really wish this would fit me, but it's not even close. It's definitely like a size small, I think. My, my overalls. <laughs> I definitely went through a long period in the 90s of being pretty obsessed with 70s style, which is funny because now like both of those eras are definitely really back in style. And uh, I think this was something from the 70s that I had thrifted in the 90s to wear. It still fits. This sweater is another piece that's from the 70s that I thrifted in the 90s. This crazy blouse is from the 90s, and I remember thrifting this, but I'm not sure if I had it like for a costume or something, because I don't remember like wearing this, you know, to high school or anything. <laughs> this feels very like B. Jones style to me, if you watch her channel. <laughs> this 90s blouse I think is really pretty still, actually. It's like a satiny material, and uh, I want to try it like tucked in and then with a leather jacket, I think. This little vintage sweater is so pretty and uh, it's a lamb's wool and silk and angora blend. It's definitely gonna be too small for me, but look at the little puff sleeves. And I need to clean it, it's got some dirt on it. This 90s Y2K denim top. I don't want to touch this one, but this actually, I think this style would be really cute if it was cropped. This was my sweater right around uh, Y2K. This was my thermal in the 90s. I remember putting this on under t-shirts. Very grunge. This is one of my favorite sweaters from the 90s. It's thrifted, it's really soft. It's from a company called The Hair. And it's got the cute rabbit on it. This 80s Victorian puff sleeve blouse. It's incredible, like if anything has come back around in style, like this is it. Two 70s blouses like this. And here's the second one.
This was my army jacket I thrifted in the 90s. Look at this rad 90s shirt. Ozone. This is a fun, dramatic, sheer top. I have it on over just a black tank top right now, but yeah, the sleeves. It might have been a costume. I don't, I don't remember what's the deal with this. This was a 90s uh, vest from Express originally, but it was thrifted. This vintage blouse is so cool. I wish it would fit me around the chest. It has wooden buttons and this lace applique top. And I think it's 100% linen. It's really cool. This vintage blouse. Some vintage Tommy for ya. Oh, I wish this still fit. It's so cute. Little embroidered denim blazer, kind of. I remember thrifting this in the 90s. It's pretty tight on me now. I just, I don't have any words for this one. jacket was part of a costume I think but it could be really cute over just a camisole and with jeans kind of I don't know I think maybe the sleeves look too short on me like they're supposed to be full length but I'm not sure <laughs> yes this white leather jacket is amazing and it's too small for me look at the puff sleeves This little velvet tuxedo jacket. It's too small for me, I couldn't pull it on. But it's in great condition. It's probably from the 90s. Here's this little, I think this is a homemade little Western bandana print skirt. That's pretty cute, that might fit me actually. Okay, this fabric is incredible, right? Vintage fabric. I think this was a costume. And uh, I think that the elastic was supposed to be tighter and maybe that this was like a strapless kind of top with the tiers. Or it was a skirt, I'm not sure. But yeah, the fabric is incredible. And there's a matching hair scarf. Well, I saved my favorite for last. This was my mother's mink coat. My great-grandfather had a mink farm. I know they're controversial, sorry, but it is vintage and I will keep it forever. Hey. 
Well, thank you for watching and sharing this vintage time capsule with me. It was a lot of fun to revisit these items and I hope you got a chance to see some cool things that you found interesting as well. So I will see you next week with another video. We've got a lot of thrift with me content and some holiday styling content coming up from this channel. So again, if you haven't already, please subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss anything and I'll see you guys next week. Am I zoomed in? Is that what's happening? No, I'm not. Okay. Oh, really? Oh, it's way too small. <laughs> and it's linen, I believe. Oh, it's so cool. I like almost fell over. <laughs> I wonder if that was obvious. <laughs> and here's the second one. I have candy in my mouth. I thought I could get away with it. <clears throat> All right, now we're starting the hall, kind of. Hello. <laughs> I can't see if everything looks okay. My hair and everything, so. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> I think, Sniffly. <sighs> Do I like that? This channel is all about thrifting. Shit. Coffee! Make my brain go. This channel is all about thrifting. Do you guys. What is this channel about? <laughs> Why can't I remember? Thrifting style. Lilo, Lilo. <laughs>